Employee health is critically important to an organization. A healthy workforce is a productive workforce, and if your associates and colleagues are in good health, they're bound to be more productive and will do a better job for the organization. Healthy employees are important to us because healthy employees are, have fewer absences, they do a better job at work, they, they are, have more energy, they have better focus. When people see the opportunities right in front of them and it's convenient, they want to do what's right, and they want to feel better too, and they want to maintain good health too, and they do it. So you feel really good when you provide those opportunities and you see that people become engaged. We model ourselves after those we respect the most, and our leaders in this community are people that are looked up to, not only in the workforce, but just in the community at large. So if they're taking this seriously, not only for their employees, but for themselves as individuals, they're truly leading by example, and I think they can have a huge impact on the health of our community. The health of the employees is becoming more and more important because health care costs are becoming a critical component of the bottom line that they, these executives have to deal with. So if they can create a culture of health within their company, if they see that around, if employees embrace that concept, it does nothing more than enhance the opportunities for businesses to grow in the region. Employees that um, are part of organizations where the CEOs are active in promoting health feel valued. They feel that they, their CEO cares about their well-being, cares about their ability to maintain good health both at work and at home. There are definitely challenges that are difficult because at the end of the day, whether it's an employee or a patient, it's about changing long-standing behaviors. It's a challenge to get a young workforce engaged in their own wellness and, and um, I think that the programs that we're putting in place with the support of the ADA uh, help to sort of focus people on, on engagement and an active lifestyle as positive and good for them and for their families and I think it resonates. Leadership is all about leading by example, and I, I thought it made an awful lot of sense to engage in the bike ride um, as an example to the other 50 or 60 people from my company who are riding. By my focusing in on getting some exercise, trying to eat well, uh, identifying healthy lifestyle is important to me, it gives them the license and the support they need to make those decisions for themselves. I think that it's incredibly important that they see the company's leader actually doing those behaviors. Our CEO, Carmel, has inspired their employees and myself to get out and walk um, around in the neighborhood of the community. We also see our CEO get out and walk um, along with us, um, which is inspire you that, you know, they're just not in the office and promote healthy, but they're being healthy themselves to encourage the employees to continue on being healthy and making those healthy choices that will help you in the long run. I have staff who come by my office and just spontaneously tell me, you know, about their health success or about the fact that they feel better than they have in years. I can see the results in our team being excited uh, about building into their life a regular exercise routine and, and eating properly. This is a, a lifelong challenge for all of us, and so um, the race will not be given to the swift but to those that endure, and so we're in it for the long haul. So it's hard to imagine the lawyer's not competitive. Yes, I'm definitely interested in how much Brian Rogers is, how much weight Brian Rogers is losing and whether I can stay ahead of him. I certainly admire and respect all the other CEOs who are in this program, and it's a privilege to be here, but I uh, certainly think I, could, I can keep up with all of them. I am totally competitive about it. When I became, um, 
one of the six CEOs involved in this initiative, I actually came back and said to my leadership team, okay, we have to beat all those other guys. It wasn't just that personally um, I would like to beat all those other guys. It's that I want my team, I want my organization to um, have fabulous results from this. Very exciting. It's also good to know that I already started in the right direction as being healthy and walking and making the right healthy choices. Thank you.